Okay, here goes the Watson Watson joke. I'm gonna hang on to the camera here <laughs> as it rocks all over the place. All right, so little Johnny was at school one day and one of the school kids said to him, little Johnny, he said, what's a what's a? And little Johnny said, I don't know, what's a what's a? He says, well, I don't know. He says, ask the teacher. Okay, little Johnny asked the teacher, what's a what's a? And the teacher says, little Johnny, how dare you ask me what's a what's a? You go straight to the principal's office. So little Johnny, not knowing anything, goes to the principal's office and he says to the principal, the teacher sent me here. And the principal says, well, what is it this time, Johnny? Well, sir, it all started this morning. Asked the teacher what's a what's a? She sent me here. The principal says, little Johnny, you get out of my school and don't ever come back again until this attitude of yours is fixed. You go straight home to your parents. So little Johnny, you know, leaves the school. He goes home to his mother. Mom is at home and mom says, little Johnny, what are you doing home early? He says, well, Mom, it all started this morning. He says, I asked the teacher what's to watch you. She sent me to the principal. As the principal wants to watch you, he sent me home to you. She says, little Johnny, how dare you? You get up to your room. You wait till your father comes home. So little Johnny goes off up to his room, and, of course, he's waiting for his dad to come home. So after work, his dad comes home, he comes upstairs where little Johnny is, and he says, little Johnny, your mom tells me there's a problem. He says, you want to tell me about it? He says, well, Dad, he says, it all started this morning. He says, ask the teacher what's a what's. He sent me to the principal. Ask the principal what's a what's. He sent me home to Mom. Ask Mom what's a what's. And she sent me up to my room waiting for you. And he says, Johnny, how dare you speak like that in my house? He says, I want you out of here. He says, and I don't want to ever see your face again. So little Johnny, of course, he gets his little satchel and his little stick. And he's walking around and around the block because he's just a little kid and he's got nowhere to go. And so about the third time around the block, this police officer's been watching him and seen him pass his path several times, and he stops him. He says, little Johnny. He says, what's going on? He says, I see you walking around in circles continuously around the block. He says, is everything okay? He says, no, officer, everything's not okay. He says, it all started this morning. He says, I asked the teacher what's to watch. He sent me to the principal. Asked the principal what's to watch. He sent me to my mom. Asked my mom what's to watch. He sent me to my room. Asked my dad what's to watch. He kicked me out of the house. The police officer says, little Johnny. He says, you should know better than this. He says, here's your court date. He says, you're going to have to go to court about this. He says, I expect some bad things for you. So little Johnny, of course, you know, a little while later, ends up going to court. And there, now he's in front of the judge. And the judge says, little Johnny, why are you in front of me in my courthouse? Little Johnny says, well, officer, or judge, he says, it all started, he says, one morning, he says, some time ago, he says, I asked the teacher what's to watch, he sent me to the principal, asked the principal what's to watch, he sent me home to my mom, asked my mom what's to watch, he sent me to my room, asked my dad what's to watch, he kicked me out of the house, asked the police officer what's to watch, and he sent me here to you. And the, the judge says to him, little Johnny, he says, that'll be seven years hard time. <laughs> and so off he goes to jail, little Johnny's in jail for seven years. And then all of a sudden, seven years come and go. Little Johnny's out one day, and he's no longer Little Johnny. Now he's Big Johnny, and he's walking the street. And he meets this guy that he knew in prison. And this guy says to him, Big Johnny, he says, uh, you know, he says, we spent some time together in prison. It's great to see you out and everything. He says, uh, how come you never told me what you were in for? He says, why were you in? And so... Little Johnny says, well, he says, you know, Bob, he says, it all happened. He says, one morning, seven years ago, he says, I asked the teacher what's to watch. She sent me to the principal. Asked the principal what's to watch. He sent me home to my mom. Asked my mom what's to watch. She sent me to my room. Asked my dad what's to watch. He kicked me out of the house. Asked the police officer what's to watch. He sent me to the judge. Asked the judge what's to watch. He sent me to jail. So now you know why I was in there for seven years. Bob says, little Johnny, or big Johnny. He says, is that all that you wanted to know, he says. He says, look, he says, the answer is right over there across the street. He says, if you go over there and you ask them, he says, you will find out right away what's a what's a. He said, this is not the big deal that you think it is. Little Johnny, or Big Johnny, after all this time, is so excited that he just looks across the street and he starts running. And he gets about halfway across the street and he gets hit by a bus and he's killed dead oh. right on the spot. <laughs> so you know the moral of this story? No. Point Look both way. ways before you cross the street. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, that's the longest joke I've ever heard. <laughs> that's that's the moral of the, the moral story. Of the so story. now you know the moral of the story. <laughs> How to keep people entertained for 20 minutes or so. <laughs>